What's going on? I'm out here taking a little hike action. A uh, very picturesque type of sky today. I think the probability of a uh, of a rainbow is potential with these kind of clouds like this. Once the uh, man, look at that dome right there, straight ahead. Almost looks like a freaking spherical object up there. Yeah, but you got a bunch of big ass picturesque clouds out here. And I'm guessing, like, look, we may see some dramatic shift during the magic window, which is fast approaching. Yeah, whoa. But, you know, whenever you see them conditions kick up like that, like, yeah, especially once the sun dips below, like a, like a canopy of cloud, it has a funny quality to it, but don't look like that's gonna happen. Looks like, oh, it could. There's another one back there behind it. But you never know. But whenever you see these conditions, like, look, uh, a vaporous clouds, you know what I'm saying? Freaking in the sun like that. Once it hits that 42 degree angle, should kick up a freaking, should kick up a, a rainbow. Hopefully I'll get to catch it, but once I get in these woods over here, uh, this side should be obscured a little bit. Unless I go to the far end of it, but uh, yesterday, freaking, was it yesterday or was it the day before, man, but I think it was yesterday. Went for a freaking heck of a long hike. And I had on these crappy socks, right? And they kept rolling down my freaking heel. So I got a freaking blister on my heel. Every freaking step, freaking is painful. It sucks. I'm gonna have to learn my lesson. Learn my lesson from that. Because as soon as I got going, I was like, man, this is gonna be a problem. But if I had turned around and went back, might have botched my whole operation so I just decided to go forward anyway fight through it and you know I'm paying the price for it now because it freaking sucks oh yeah that's a nice guy yeah the sky's always the dopest when there's the most variance and with the most contrast you see all these clouds how they're dark and these ones are illuminated you know what I'm saying? So it sets off different. You almost got like an aquamarine kind of and then a metallic gray. You got whitish gray, soft. You know, you got lit up. Then you got these in the shade, in the shadows, clouds. So greatest variance, man, makes the dopest displays. Oh, I'm not seeing any. No cameras going across right now. I mean, but they was here and like right there you see one of those long clouds those freaking long twister clouds uh, popping up right there I know down south man there was some freaking pretty deadly tornado action I think a couple people died in a freaking tornado event so we got some wicked weather flying around this is the very end of tornado alley right here but in the winter time, since we're so cold, it freaking normally don't see a lot of winter tornadoes once in a blue moon. But down south, on the other hand, you can get a it's warmer. Damn. Yeah, there's a steady prevalent wind hitting on it right here. at the end of the day, I bet. It's gonna be a bunch of pinks, reds, and purples. That golden color's already kinda on the color.
light beam. Cool. Looks like it's far out a light beam.